Hi folks. Um, I don't really have much to offer this week. I can't bear the thought of sitting down at the computer for even the little bit of time it takes for me to put an episode together. It's not that I don't want to share or that um, I want to make this sound like it was worse than it was this week because it wasn't so terribly bad. It wasn't a great week. It wasn't a bad week. It was just um, a week of a lot of different things, and um, it, it was just a week. So, um, but that's really not why I don't have anything to share. I have spent so much time on the computer, just like everybody else, I'm sure most everybody that um, is watching this did this week, and I can't bear the thought of putting myself in front of a computer to write what I need to say, and I am horrible at talking off the cuff. So, um, I just want to offer to everyone that um, <laughs> these are just weird times, and we just need to stay with what we know, or stay with the things that are really good for us, um, and don't get drug down into the pit of... Um, despair and so that you give up on things. Don't, don't ever give up. It was uh, a week of some new revelation for me. I have said before, I said I think last week, that I really look forward to my walks, um, both morning and evening and my yoga, but I never thought that I would be anxious for the alarm to go off at 4.30 in the morning ever in my life. However, I was this week because once it went off for an hour from a little before five to a little before six was my time. My time to go walking or do what I wanted to do and needed to do for me. So, um, so words of advice, find that thing that makes you want to get up every morning. Um, and I know this sounds like I didn't like school or that it wasn't good to see the kids. It was. It was really great to see the kids. Um, and maybe as a music teacher, it's just different. But I know that a couple times David and I kind of hit a wall this week because we really just want to make music. And we kind of did. We kind of did. But it was just really different and hard, hard to get there because of all of the things that we need to be teaching the kids to do so that if we have to go virtual, we can make music. And, uh, and so it puts making music right now on hold. So anyway, that's where we are. That's where we are with life. And we need to live in the present. That's what our little motivational speech was for the kids on Friday. Because um, so many of them are worried about what they aren't going to get to do this year. Uh, and, you know, we need to take our own medicine to heart. Um, you got to live in the present. You can't worry about what you used to be able to do. And you can't wish your life to the future and what you hope to be able to do, you have to make today the important day because it may be all we have. And so uh, we have to make it count. We have to live in the moment and we have to enjoy the process of learning whatever we need to learn. So anyway, uh, like I said, I don't talk well off I just can't sit down to write something down this time. Not because I can't put my thoughts together. I'm probably good. I just don't want to spend any more time at the computer because I'm going to get to be there all day tomorrow for school. Things that I need to get ready for my students so that maybe we can sing this week and maybe we can play this week in band or work on the color guard stuff and the things that, that have meaning for um, Mr. P, Mrs. P, and our students. So... Hopefully, next week, I'll be able to share a little bit more, and maybe I'll have time to sit down and, and 
want to sit down at the computer and do something for uh, an episode to encourage everyone. And I hope that this isn't a discouraging episode, but I've said all along that this is a journey, right? And so this is where I'm at in the journey today and this week. And um, there are a, a whole country full of teachers and students together. So on to something new and a, and a week to look forward to. Until then, God bless. Have a great rest of your weekend and enjoy what we have.